20 year old girl from a working class family has always wanted to be a nurse. It feels like her vocation. She is putting herself through university to train, but is finding it an expensive business. To maintain herself on her course, she has had to work as a waitress and borrow money from loan sharks, but she is getting more and more into debt. She can't make ends meet anymore, and her family have no money to help her. Desperate, she has turned to prostitution to try and contain her spiralling debts. Although she is careful and takes precautions, she still feels what she is doing is wrong. Not only because she believed that she should not use other people as a means to an end, but also because one day she had hoped to fall in love. She is also worried about abuse, rape, disease, and possible pregnancy. But she has balanced her duty to become a nurse with the risks. And the economic reality is she can make more money in one night in the sex industry by sleeping with two clients than she can normally earn in a week as a waitress. Leaving his hotel in the same city, a married businessman 200 miles from home begins driving around looking for sex. While he is missing his wife on these long business trips, he is also missing sex. He approaches the young woman in his car and quite quickly they reach an agreement and promises are made about the exchange of money for sex. The sex is consensual, an agreement by two adults has been made. So is there a problem? If you universalise that you have sex with other people to fulfil your duty, can you universalise that? Can you say in every situation that you should prostitute yourself to get to where you want to be, which I don't think you can really because that will cause so much trouble.